Do you ever get that feeling you're being watched? <laughs> These two showed up. I think they're the Westville boys. And uh, they're eating blueberry muffins and dry dog food. And we got some water out there for them. And I had some hot dogs, but I gave them to the crows this morning because I didn't want them to go bad. So anyway, here they are. They were hungry. <laughs> yes, they sure were. The hungry little fellas. They like the muffins though. Yeah, the lights were all off and everything. And I, I, I turned the dining room light on. There was these two faces in the window looking at me. So what do you do? You, I mean, you got to feed them. The poor little fellas. They're out of hibernation. Well, it's uh, the snow took a beating again. It's all off the roof. And uh, the yard's bare. And I got some uh, worms for the uh, the robin. But uh, she's out digging in the grass again, so she doesn't need the apples anymore. And uh, so she's getting food out of the grass. And so I took the worms and I gave them to the, the blue jays and they ate them. They're going to have some water. Yeah, and the water's not cold, it's tepid water. Oh, they're having a good old feed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's... What's he washing? All the dry food. I got some cookies there. should put some cookies out. Oh, I guess the muffins are alright. I could throw some out there. <laughs> he's having a great time there. What's he washing? All the dry food. And the food's not frozen. I just put it out and they're eating it as I put it out so it's still warm. So. Yeah, they were hungry. Poor little fellas. I'll put a few cookies out there. Okay, we just add some cookies to the mix. Well, still staying on the hard food, so we'll have to put some more of that out. And you know, that stuff is good for them. That's a fresh bag I opened. It's got all the nutrition and everything. It's not cheap stuff, it's uh, the, good, the good expensive stuff that I buy. It's got lots of nutrients and everything in it. What's he doing? Oh, he's into the water. I'm surprised there's nobody else coming up here. They keep looking. It might be they smell the food. We still got lots of snow on the ground there though. I can see from here there's about a good two feet there yet. But there's a lot of places opened up on the front part so the, the birds can get at the, the worms and stuff. What are you going to do? Oh, you're going to have a muffin, are you? Okay.
they'll work at that for quite a while. I, I'm sure that's the Westful boys because when I open the door they don't run away. Yeah. Yeah, my friend Bud Rudolph dropped them off here last year. There was a third one, too. With these two sort of stuck together. See how they're, they're, they're laying up against each other? See, they were raised together, see? I'm glad they came here. At least they had a good chance. <clears throat> so they survived the winter. That's good. The other fellow's not fitting in the water at all. <clears throat> yes, I'm still here watching you. They know I'm not a threat, so they're not worried about it. He said, what else is there? No hot dogs. No, no hot dogs. We got some in the freezer. If I knew they were coming out, I'd have them thawed out. But with well, the way the weather's been and the temperature's been changing, it's pretty hard to, uh, to gauge whether or not to take them out or not. But they get, they get long on that. And I got lots of bread there and peanut butter, too. <clears throat> and I got new peanut butter. It's called Goop. <clears throat> and it's peanut butter and jam mixed together. We'll try that out on them. Well, anyway, we'll post this. See how it does. Well, this is uh, Tuesday night at 10 o'clock. Connor's up on the, uh, he's up on the table, aren't you? That's the Connor cat. <laughs> Charlotte. So I gotta go <clears throat> see what date it is, because I can't remember. I got the game on there too, it's the 8th. 8th of March, 10 o'clock at night. Right, Connor? You're going to have a bite. Okay, bud. <clears throat> so, well, thank you for watching. And if you did not subscribe, hit the subscribe button. And um, pretty soon they'll be all out in full force. The babies won't be here until, uh, well, they got to be born yet. But they won't be here until probably... Usually it's around the end of June. Last two weeks of June, first week of July. When I, and they're about eight weeks old when they get here. So mom keeps them in the den until they're able to walk and get on their own and everything. Right, Charlotte? <laughs> anyway, people, we'll go and put this up on the, uh, on the YouTube and Facebook, and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.